Culers, estic preparat. Okay guys, thank you for joining. This is Barca360 and you're welcome back to the channel. So Barcelona have been in the market looking for a defensive midfielder for a few seasons at this point with Sergio Busquets edging towards the final juncture of his career. The Blaugranes want to send a long-term replacement for the Spaniard. The club's top choice for the position has been Martin Zubimendi of Real Sociedad. However, the Real Sociedad midfielder has a release clause of 60 million euros, which does not fit in Barcelona's budget at all. Therefore, they have been keeping tabs on other players as alternatives, such as Wolverhampton Wanderers, who will be nervous. While one Laporta really appreciates the player, Xavi has discarded his signing for the summer, as per reports by Xavi Miguel. The Portuguese midfielder does not fit into the club's plans. The president had also spoken about Neves earlier this year, saying Neves is a great player, but this is part of private conversations. Musket will not last forever and there are internal discussions to find a replacement for him. Earlier reports had stated that Barcelona had offered the chance to sign Neves in the summer in exchange for Ansuman Fati and Cash. The coaching staff do not want Fati to leave though and are evidently not in favour of signing Ruby Neves either. That said, Neves is enjoying a tremendous 2022-2023 season at Wolves, having scored six goals across 31 games so far. He has largely played as a single pivot, but Xavi believes his profile fits a double pivot more. Further, Barcelona have started to prioritize a move for Sufian Amrabat in that position, as they see him as the best fit for the role over Ruby Neves. The Moroccan is expected to cost around 25 to 30 million euros. However, if they cannot move for Amrabat in the summer, they will turn their attention towards Guido Rodriguez, who has convinced the Barcelona coaching staff a lot. So cool, that will be all for now. If you like this video, you may consider hitting on the like button, subscribe and share as well. Thank you very much for watching and I will see you in the next video.